Now staying with the cornerback theme, Utah State's Nevin Lawson hopes to continue the trend of Aggies being selected in the draft since the rise of the program under Gary Anderson and Matt Wells. Lawson was a four-year starter in Logan. He was second team all WAC as a junior and first team all Mountain West as a senior. He led the team with 17 passes defensed and was second with four interceptions during his senior year. He was an important member of a Utah State defense that finished the 2013 season, ranked seventh in the country in scoring defense. Lawson was also invited to the combine and posted solid numbers. 4.4 in the 40-yard dash and a 33-inch vertical jump. He was even better at Utah State Pro Day with a blazing 4.3 40 time and 34 and a half inch vertical leap. Hans Olsen's back with a breakdown on Lawson. I don't know if he's ever going to be a starter in the NFL. Now, I don't want to doubt him because he certainly has some of the abilities to be a starter, but his size is going to be a little bit of a concern. Now, he makes up for that in aggression and strength. Believe it or not, Nevin Lawson is an extremely strong corner. He's a kid that as a receiver comes into him, he can get those hands into him. He's got the strength to hold him, to push him to where he wants them to go. He can get down the field and he can run with probably any receiver in the NFL right now. So he can get out and run with you. And he's impressed a lot of NFL scouts. I think Nevin Lawson has worked himself into the fourth or fifth round area in the draft. I think he's a definite draft pick. And I think he's going to be a solid contributor in the NFL. Now the mock drafts would uh, follow what Hans says there, that Lawson's a player that could land anywhere from the middle rounds to late rounds, but looks to have a great chance to get drafted no matter what. SI.com has him as high as 111th overall in the fourth round. As you can see there, NFL.com has him going as high as 101 to the Houston Texans. 